Hi, Bellas and here from Last Penny Magazine. And this is another example that record labels are giving us the chance to go back in time without using a TARDIS and, and to, to discover things that we were either too young, we didn't have enough money, or we didn't feel safe enough in taking a risk and to see what it was all about when the older kids at school were listening to those strange albums with that strange smoke coming out of their, the common rooms, etc. Well, this is one of those bands, and they're both from Esoteric, and it's from it's Jade Warrior. The first album from 1971, and the follow-up from 1972. They've just been remastered and reissued, and Jade Warrior albums are very hard to find and incredibly expensive on, on vinyl. So this is a great way to, to, to get them. So I'm just going to show you inside the digipacks. So Jade Warrior, I had two albums up to this point, Floating World from 74 and Way of the from 78, which were early CDs from Ireland. And I've always wanted to go backwards in time to learn more about this band. And now, thanks to Esoteric and Cherry Red Records, I can. And this is the first one from 1971. Nice digipack. Uh, you've also got a bonus track as well. And um, they each come with little booklets with an essay um, about the music. So you've got some positioning of what was going on and about the band. Nice bit of artwork there as well more detail you also get the lyrics as well so you can see here that Steve Pilkerton did the essay in February 2022 so this is hot off the press um, as I say you've got the, the lyrics as well and then the credits to the end and Esoteric just do fantastic jobs on these reissues so that's the first one from 71 and then the next one 72 is called Last Autumn's Dream and um, this also comes with a isn't that a great design isn't that an absolutely superb design for those of you who must have a vinyl version but this is feels tactile as well so these cds are wonderful ways of collecting these records that would cost you an arm and a leg to be honest uh, and again you've got um an essay which is really good giving you some perspective what's going on pictures of the band and again Steve Pilkerton's essay and we've got the lyrics and then the credits as well and I say this is superb superb actually remastering as well by Ben Wiseman and both of them are highly recommended if you're into if recommended even if you're into British prog and rock history these are well worth checking out that's Jade Warrior Last Autumn's Dream and the Debut album from 1971, out on Esoteric, again from Cherry Red Records. Superb slices of prog and rock from the dark and lost ages of music, if you like. Um, but I'm really enjoying these. It's great. To, and it's, I just love it. I just love the fact we can go backwards and forwards in time, you know, and I love doing the new music roundup videos. But you can see the, the lineage from the you know rock music now because rock is alive and kicking going back to again this other time this other time when bands were again struggling to get heard and be seen if now spinning had been around in 1971 i'd have done a video just like this so thank you for watching thank you for being here thank you for all of your support and i shall see you on my next video mm -hmm.